It's a fatherly nice morning. Since Rexy woke up from her nap, she started on to the hunt. Ready to hunt. Dylan and little Dylan were almost ready to go on their adventure. Also Blue saw some. It was someone that has returned. It is Carno. Carno has returned to his new long before his home and that he never returned since 16 years. Carno was roaring. He went everyone's in his way that he was ready to hunt something. That he hunted a little, little hovervore that survived. He can smell him far away, but actually he didn't see him at all cost. Because hovervores died on the last island of Dinosaur Island. They died over there. And that's why there's only carnivores here. So yeah, that's why. That, Quaylen was ready to hunt Dylan and Little Dylan. But he, but since he didn't expect something, the Indominus Rex. The Indominus Rex woke up from his finally sin nap but then he she can hear his roar then he walked over there Arno didn't see nothing he just looked at the plants and decided to eat them since they were disgusting they only like meat but then he didn't know was Rexy saw anything. She cannot believe it. It was Carno since the whole entire time that she appeared again. Carno was no longer dead. Then Rexy decided to go. Came talking with this queen, the queen of the monsters, queen of the dinosaurs, told the Adominus Rex how he got But then, she didn't want to talk about that. She wanted to fight. She grabbed the Indominus Rex by the neck. But then the Indominus Rex bite her neck first. She grabbed her by the neck and she pulled her down. Then she was almost about to be defeated. Because the Adominus Rex is 10 times stronger than the T-Rex. The one only can beat her is Dylan. But then Dylan wasn't strong enough. Then after that, Rexy was almost about to die, she thinks. But then she heard something, the Adominus. And guess who it was? <laughs> then the Adonis Rex tried getting down. He tried to bring her down, but Blue fell too. She couldn't get up. Got up to the Adonis Rex, and she was up top, but she fell again. But she can't. She can't give up. So she tried biting her, biting the Adonis. The T Rex tried getting up too, but Rexy. Rexy tried her best. The Dominus Rex tried roaring. Trying to get it out. Blue tried, won't get out because she won't. Because this is her friend. Since after that, Rexy grabbed by, by the T-Rex's mouth. But then, since then, after that, T-Rex got to the ground and Blue fell. But since she didn't see behind her, after that, one got the Dominus Rex on the ground. 
then he tripped on a branch and he fell. Then after that, Dylan got grabbed by the neck, and the Indominus won't let go. He threw him into a forest grass. Blue got up, and she couldn't let go. But then Blue got thrown. After that, Rexy got up. Rexy got up, and then Blue went up on her side. Then Rexy bit down the Indominus. After that, Rexy tried biting him down. After that, Rexy got pulled, and then she was thrown. Then she got bitten. Then Blue went up to him again. Went to the ground, and after that, she pulled him to the ground. But then Blue threw him over there. After that, Dylan got up. And then after that, it was about time. Dylan's death. Then he got grabbed by the mouth. Almost about it. After that, he got pulled to the ground. Wouldn't get up. And that's why that Dylan spine. <coughs> Crap. Dylan died, and he never moved a muscle. The Dominus Rex ran. That little Dylan came, and that he was sad. Then, which he lived with, was Rexy, since he was nice to him. To <clears throat> that, Dylan, little Dylan, lived with Rexy and Blue. Blue didn't know where to live by the Adamus Rex, so she, she decided to live in, you know, Rexy's home. Since after that, five years later. After that, Dylan, little Dylan, lived with Rexy and Blue. Blue didn't know where to live by the Adamus Rex, so she, she decided to live in, you know, Rexy's home. Since after that, five years later. Five months later, years. little Dylan, years I mean, little Dylan has grown up. He's just like his father, but he's different now. But he he's ready to he wanted revenge on the Adamus no. Rex. So, the revenge came on. Since after that, Quaylen decided to join too. So after that, they were ready to go. All the dinosaurs went with blue. And then, that blue came in. And after that, what happens next in episode 4?